everybody, it's Tuff, and today I'm going to be talking about my favorite products that I was using during the month of February. Kind of explains the whole thing, so I don't think there's really much need for a whole intro, long thing talking, so let's just get into it. My first favorite product is one that I've talked about before. It's kind of not necessarily a rediscovered product, but one that I just started using again. It's Philosophy's Hope in a Jar. Yes, I did a review on that. I'll link it in the bottom bar below if you're interested, but I was trying out a different moisturizer for a little while, and then I switched back to Hope in a Jar, and it just made me realize how amazing this stuff is. My skin's super moisturized, and I just love it. So if you haven't tried it already, go ahead and try it. You can also check out my review. Again, link in the bottom bar down below. The next product that I want to talk about is a concealer that I've been using lately. It is a pixie concealer in this cute little container. It is the Brightening Peach Correction Concealer. And it is kind of a pink tone and this is meant to cancel out blue circles underneath the eyes. Lately I've been going for more natural makeup so I've just been using a light coverage foundation this under my eyes and usually that's pretty much it. I've been pretty lucky so far with blemishes except this bugger right here which is kind of bugging me. I don't need to put anything else on top of this. It just blends in with the rest of my foundation really great while still having those pink tones to cancel out the blue of my under eye bags. This month I've been finding myself reaching for cream shadows more than usual and I really love this one by Forever 21. It is a really, really pretty peach tone and it is in the shade Two Shoes. And what I do with this is I will put it on my lid all the way up to my brow and that will be it for my eyeshadow. And then I'll go in with an eyeliner. Sometimes I'll do a bolder liner, sometimes I'll do something simple, but it's a really fun way to be able to play with liner while still doing a pretty, like, you know, neutral almost no makeup look. For lipstick, I've really been loving this Makeup Forever one. I just have a mini, but it's in the shade N9, and it is the birthday present, I believe, from last year from Sephora, and it's just a really beautiful, universally flattering color. I'm wearing it right now, and I just really love it. As you can see, I still have a little bit left. I've just found myself reaching for this a lot during the month of February, and I'm really kind of excited to use it up so I can buy a full one, because it's just an awesome color, and I really recommend it. So let's back up a couple steps and talk about primer. I've been using this one by Bare Minerals. It's the Prime Time Brightening Illuminating Formula. It has a little bit of subtle shimmer in it, but you don't really see it once you put it on the skin. And I just feel like it works. It really keeps my foundation on. It really gives me a little bit of a glow, but for someone who has oily skin, it still doesn't really make me oily or glisten or anything that I want to stay away from. It just works and that's why I love it. For hair I have two favorites, both of which are in trial sizes. The first one is the Bumble and Bumble Repair Blow Dry Cream and it just works really well on my hair. I take maybe a pea sized amount, put it on the ends of my hair and I feel like my hair has been a lot healthier since I've started using it. I've been using it pretty much for the whole month of February, maybe a little bit longer. But anyway, this stuff is kind of awesome. And the other product that I've really been loving for hair, it is the Oil of Morocco Argan Oil Hairspray. This stuff smells amazing and it really works great soft flexible hold while actually holding because I feel like a lot of the hairsprays that have a flexible hold don't actually hold but this one totally does and as I said it smells amazing but it also dissipates so you're not like smelling it on your hair the whole day. And my last three favorites are nail favorites. The first one is the Orly Nail Defense Base Coat. I was having major problems with my nails peeling like the actual nail peeling and chipping not the polish and this is really cleaned it up. I've been using this for maybe two months now. It's absolutely amazing so I totally recommend if that's an issue that you're having and then I've been having two favorite nail colors this month first one is the one that I'm wearing it is by OPI it's this beautiful royal purple and it is in Dutch Adjust Love OPI it was part of their Dutch collection and in fact it's the one that I used for my royal purple nail tutorial that I did last year so I will link that in the bottom bar below if you're interested the other color that I've really been loving is this beautiful green by Julep, and I'm usually not a green polish fan, but this is just so gorgeous, and when I wore it, I got so many compliments. I've just been loving it, and it is in the color Liz Anne. 
So yeah, totally recommend that as well. And that's pretty much it for my February favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Leave me a comment if you've tried any of these products, letting me know what you think of them. And remember to subscribe for more videos from me. Also check out my Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Links in the bottom bar below. And I'll see you beauties next time. Bye.